Welcome back, everyone. To grow your business, it isn't necessarily what you know, but who you know that can make all the difference. You can have the best product or service out there, but if no one knows about it, you can't expect your business to grow on its own. Very true. That's why it's so important for any business to develop and maintain a strong network of professionals who can help spread the word about its products or services and refer new customers to the business. Tom Fleming is here with more. Good to have you here. I'm excited to be here. You say referral-based marketing is yeah. so valuable. Explain to us what exactly that is. Sure, absolutely. It's, it's the process of business professionals attracting business to themselves through referrals by other business professionals, friends, and associates. Um, I think it would be great to have a goal of doing business with prospects coming to us to want to buy rather than us having to get out there and sell constantly. True. Sure. So who would this actually be good for? What kind of professions? What kind of professionals? Professionals that don't have a big advertising budget are in a high trust type of business. Financial planners, insurance agents, realtors, mortgage originators, attorneys, veterinarians, uh, garage mechanics yeah. uh, rely on referrals if we don't want to take our car to someone who we maybe don't trust. Yeah. I think a lot of people, when they think about networking and marketing, they think, okay, I've got to join the, the Breakfast Business Club, mm -hmm. and I'm going to go there every Monday, and we're all going to talk about business, and I'm going to give out my cards to everybody in there. I'm done. That is the start of the process. That's an essential part of the process. But most people don't realize that actually doing business by referral begins with shaking hands and passing out business cards but it goes far beyond that and and that's what we teach through the programs we offer is what is the relationship development process look like beyond that to generate the knowing the liking and trusting with business professional to b business professional. Okay, can you expand on that a little bit because if someone's out there and they say, you know what, I want to put together a referral-based marketing plan myself. Yes. I just I want to create something. I want free. I want free advertising, free marketing. <laughs> let's Absolutely. Just say. Yes. How do they go about making that plan? Well, I think first we want to define who our target market is, who we want to sell to, and what our message is to those people. Okay. And then we want to identify who can help us reach that target market. What are other business professionals? that do business with that exact same target market and target the relationship development process with those people. So it, my goal would be to surround myself with people who can pass me business all day, every day. Sure, but obviously if they're in the same type of business as you, those are not the people you want to go after because you're their competition. So they're not going to help you out. Correct, so you but if I'm, if I'm an accountant right. and I develop a relationship with an attorney who does the same Right. Uh, a different business with the same clients and we can cross refer people back and forth to one another then I'm in a relationship with someone who can pass me business all day every day and it really has to work both ways because if you are always take 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 and not give 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 you won't be getting 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 much anymore that's right it, it's <laughs> about reciprocity it's about being in a mutually beneficial relationship mm. but overall referral based marketing that it, this is one piece of the big puzzle for your marketing um, agenda for any company it's it's just one piece of the puzzle or do you believe someone can strictly base their entire marketing um, you know their marketing plan on just referral based marketing I think it's one piece of the puzzle absolutely uh, our goal as a business owner is to create buzz sure. and there's many ways we can create buzz about our products and services but when, when we're working with small and medium-sized business owner their resources to advertise do expensive direct mail so on and so forth it can be limited right. and so referral based marketing Marketing, developing an expertise in that is important as the foundation of growing our business. Really quickly, Tom, can people try this on a trial basis? See if it works? Uh, yes, our firm, uh, the Referral Institute, has trainings uh, all over the country, all over the world, actually. Okay, good. Yes. So they can get started this afternoon. With introductory sessions. All right. Hey, Perfect. if it's free, it's for me, and I'll take free, right? <laughs> hey, everybody's looking to get more marketing for less. Yes, they are. Tom Fleming, thank you. We'll put your website on ours, okay, so people will know how to get there and uh, take their business to the next level. Thank you, ladies, very much. Thank and you. again, our website is daytimeonline.tv. Still to come, find out why one expert says resumes are worthless. Hmm. <laughs>